right, here they come. This is the corn. And yes, it is late. There's corn in there too. It is late. Um, I got distracted and was doing other things. But the big corn is already back there. This is the second batch. And it is actually doing quite well. Um, as you can see, I cut down holes that were maybe six to eight inches deep and planted the corn in the bottom. All of these holes have corn coming up except this one. So I'll be keeping an eye on that one and see what happens. But the rest of them have corn coming up and it is almost up to ground level. Um, well, <laughs> a third is away to ground level. Close enough. By next week, it'll be up to ground level. <clears throat> so, um, that is the corn for this year. And actually, um, it does get culinary water. This is not a dry patch. But, um, I watered, when I watered them, I filled the holes. And this is what I would do in a dry area, in a dry um, garden. Um, I dug the holes, filled the holes with water and then planted down into the mud at the bottom. And they have come up on that water, on the water that I put in when I started. So I think between the holes and the water when I started them, um, these are going to do quite well. We'll have to wait and see, of course, and I kind of wish that I had done this in a dry area, but that would mean watering by hand and um, others in the family did not want to do uh, the corn that way. So um, I will talk with you later.